I was sick for two days and Emily didn't, didn't notice. I was sick too, so that's probably why I didn't notice. I know, I was like, I didn't leave the bed, or my bed for two days. Did you think that was weird behavior? I thought you just had work to do. <laughs> In bed. Anyways, I didn't do, yeah. Anyways. I do what I love, I do what I love, and I love what I do. Welcome to a new video. <laughs> my name is Julia if you've never seen my channel before and we are currently in Phuket, Thailand. We're on a three month storytelling trip. So we are walking now to have a team lunch. It's Wednesday so we do Where Are You At Wednesday and we're having a production meeting to just discuss a bunch of the shoots we had coming up and the one we had last night. And my microphone is like wobbly so I don't know if that's making the sound bad. Sorry. with one of the world race contacts right now and they have a team from K-Squad, an all-female team. And so we've been following around them. They're basically their church and they do a lot of ministry to different people um, of different, I don't wanna give away too many specifics just yet because we're still kind of investigating what the story is gonna be. But basically, a lot of the people they minister to are sort of unlikely characters, like people that are kind of like cast asides, um, which is the heartbeat of Jesus and the heartbeat of the Bible, and it's very exciting. And so that's kind of what we're going after. Um, in my last vlog, I talked about an event where we were passing out flowers to the women on the streets. We used our point and shoots and like GoPros and iPhones last night. We didn't use our big cameras because actually this environment is insane. It is nothing like Siem Reap. It is nothing like um, Bangkok. It is nothing like anywhere I've ever been. Like it is intense. It is, I'm about to swear, it is like hell on earth. And there's actually a lot about it that I'm not even really comfortable discussing on my vlog because you never know. So go look it up. Go research it. Um, but it is disgusting and horrible and yeah I go look it up um but we took little cameras because it was quite dangerous for us to have big ones and so I just used my little point and shoot which I haven't been using a lot lately and we went out in little groups and we um we passed out flowers it was really cool because the women of K-Squad had been doing this all month and so they had relationships that they were building upon and um that was really cool now I want to give you a room tour because our room is pretty cool. So this is the hallway. I think it looks a lot like um, like an elementary school because it's so big. This is our room. It is so shabby chic. It reminds me of like the 70s and we've moved in. So we have our clothes here, we have my backpack, we have some stuff, we have Emily's stuff, we have our bathroom that has a really slow light. <laughs> and you know, that's exciting. We have this really cool purple rug that says welcome. And then we have Emily who's hiding because she's sick. Pray for Emily. We have some Valentine's here. Happy Valentine's Day! It's like summer camp vibes. We have our journals, fresh towels. We have the shoe section over here, you know, our desk. This is the kitchen. It's really popping. We have instant coffee, um, bread, Reese's, yogurt, butter, you know, the essentials. And this is our uh, charging station for all of our charging needs. And that is Phuket. The broken curtain. Now, to end this vlog, we're gonna have Bible study with the church and with K-Squad, and then we are going to do volleyball ministry, which is super cool, um, and probably gonna be a part of the story that we end up telling for the project. Okay, I didn't 
film anything in Bible study, but it was really good. Owen and Kelsey talked. Now we're playing volleyball. I'm really sweaty. I just played two games. It's terrifying because these people are very good. Yeah. We, I'm, I'm, um, my athleticism is like hit or miss. Today I think it was like. You did great. It's better than I thought. She was on my team. Yeah. She was also giving her best. <laughs> also not being very successful. Oh but did, did a couple things. You know. Yeah. It was fun. These people are amazing. Yeah. So good. It was terrifying. I was really scared. Okay, my friend Moth me here. Yeah. He's gonna do my eyebrows. Yeah. Wow, okay. Go ahead. Okay. Do you think they look good? Yes, good. Yeah? Yes. Okay. <laughs> oh, I need to put my hair down. Hang bon, hang bon, er, lang bon. Hmm? Yes. What is your name? Hmm? Your name? Um, I'm two men. I'm two men. I like them. I like them. They look wild. Yes, I think good. Do okay, like right, man. Whoa. Do you want to be in my video? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, thanks. Okay, now I'm getting my hair done. Things are getting serious. Lemon. <laughs> I, you know, I don't think my eyebrows look bad. What do you think? I think I they look like wonderful eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> I can't really eyebrows. see them very well. I think they look gigantic. But you know, that's really in right now, Owen. <laughs> Okay, we are back now, and I just got a good look at my eyebrows. I'm looking at them right now on the screen. I couldn't really see them on the beach. They look crazy. <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So what happened was Masme, or Mas, Masami is his name, and I noticed he had like awesome eyebrows. And I was like, do you got them waxed? Like, I want to get mine waxed. And he was like, oh, I'll do yours. And I thought he was going to pluck my eyebrows, and I was like, oh gosh. Oh no, I was, but he comes back with this gigantic makeup pen. I was like, well, all right. So he did my eyebrows, he did my hair. But I'm gonna end this vlog. Thanks for watching it. Um, I got to stand on my camera. Thanks for watching it, and I will see you in the next one. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't, and give it a thumbs up. Okay, bye.